Yeah, I mean, it was special. Right, here we are, guys. We're here with Liam. Liam, nice to meet you, Liam. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. So, the question I've got for you today is who do you think Peter Bree United's goal scorer is going to be? Uh, first goal scorer, John O. John O? Yeah. Do you think John O's in good form or? Uh, yeah, I think I think he's kind of picked up himself after, you know, nearly leaving to Bristol. I think I think he knows he's going to be here until January at least. So yeah, perfect. Can I get your score predictions for today? Uh, three 0 Three 0 Yeah. Yeah. And John o, the first goal John scorer. O, first goal scorer. And yeah. your favourite Peter Bree United chant. Take me home. Take me home. London Road <laughs> to the place where I belong. Past the cobblers, past the Cambridge. Take me home, London Road. Thank you very much, Liam, mate. Enjoy the game. Right, I'm here joined by Hugo. Hugo, nice to meet you, nice Hugo. To meet you, nice to meet you. So I'm going to ask you again the same yeah. question as Liam. What was your uh, Peterborough United goal scorer for today? Ephraim Mason Clark. Ephraim Mason Clark. Yeah. yeah, perfect. And I'll ask you uh, for your score predictions for today. I think it's going to be 2-0 Posh. 2-0 Posh. Yeah. And finally, your favourite Peterborough United. Me. Take charm. me home. Take me home, London Road. Same as Liam, then. Yeah. yeah no problem. Thank you very much for joining me today. Thank Cheers. you. I'm here with Logan. Logan, nice to meet you, Logan. My question for you is, um, what is the first Peterborough United goal scorer today? I'm going to say John O'Bags one. I reckon he should. He's been on all right form lately. Not too bad. Perfect. And I'll ask you uh, for your uh, score Ooh, predictions that, for this that, evening. I reckon it's two 0 Bosch. Two 0 Bosch. John O and Ephraim Mason Clark. John O and Ephraim Mason Clark. Awesome, awesome. And what is your favourite Peterborough United chant? Uh, it's got to be, I reckon, Take Me Home, London Road. Perfect. No problem. Thank you very much for joining me, Logan. Ball time there, and Posh 2, Lincoln Neil. A great win. Max, what do you think of the game? Yeah, I mean, it was special. It was special. What a game. What a performance. Look, I loved every second of it. From the moment I kicked off to when Mark... From you Mark, kicked off. Yeah, yeah, from the moment they kicked off. <laughs> from the moment they kicked off, to, uh, or we kicked off I forgot already um, to the moment that both the goals went in I loved every second brilliant win I thought the first half wasn't amazing um, Lincoln probably could have scored but second half much better I don't think it was very good first half I didn't really think it was very good first I've just said that so I've just said the same yeah, thing twice Sam's a bit more sober so let's come to him first half it was dull nothing happening the end piece wasn't there they could have had a few goals when they kept on the counter. Then second half, picked it up straight away and got the goal within seven minutes. Mm. Had your booty scored. <laughs> yeah, cheers, Tom. Um, By the way, what a fluky goal that was. <laughs> right, I'm going to come to you with man of the matches. Who are we going to go with? Joel Randall. You're not going to give it to your boy? No, Joel Randall. What a blur. What a blur. Look, I love your boy. Great goal. No, Great goal. But Joel Randall's is better. I'm going Joel Randall just to, just to annoy Charlie, really. Uh, Add your boy, he was awful. All he did was score a goal. Sam, man of the match. Archie Collins just picked up everything yeah. in the field. I gotta agree there. Archie Collins, great player. He goes unnoticed. Underrated player, in my opinion. Well, we went one nil up and we didn't bottle it, so great stuff. Yeah, no, definitely, and especially after Carlisle and and Derby and Portsmouth and and, Link, uh, and Leighton Orient and almost oh. Cheltenham. Um, it was it was a brilliant, oh. brilliant performance, and considering that we didn't bottle it made my day because I was fully expecting us to go 1-0 up and even Hamilton to score the equaliser and I'd be jumping off London Road so no look brilliant I'm, I'm very happy very happy up the push up the push